Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. We're back at it trying to pull ultra rare cards. In today's video, it is Wednesday, and you know what that means. Dollar Pack Battle Wednesday. Again, guys, welcome back to the channel. I hope you have enjoyed the previous video. Sorry I did not get to upload Monday. Um, I was a bit tied up, so I was not able to get any videos out. But I will do it next Monday. Um, I also had some issues getting my notifications on comments on my last video. So I really didn't get to see everybody's comment at all until I was like, wait, I didn't get no comments. What's going on? So I checked it out and something's going on with my uh, YouTube app, uh, not uh, studio, not working properly. But I'm going to read all those comments and uh, go ahead and get back to you guys on that. But I did see that uh, Dave Third Eye Wood did uh, comment that he wants to see those mystery power box open on Mondays. So just so you guys know, we do have one right here. And we'll open up that on Monday. This upcoming Monday. We won't open it Friday because they did comment they wanted to see it Monday. And as far as you guys uh, remember, this channel was based on opening mystery power boxes. They ran out of mystery power boxes, so I couldn't open as many as I'd like to. But I did open quite a bit. Uh, but without further ado, guys, we'll go ahead and get into today's pack battle uh, between Sword and Shield and Sword and Shield. And Sword and Shield. And four more Sword and Shields. So we have four uh, pack cards. For Sword and Shield, and we got four packs of each. Hopefully, we get something good this time. Last time, we only pulled two V cards, and we got destroyed by a big tooth HD. They did great. They had a great video. Uh, her daughter uh, was doing an amazing pull rate. That means she got that full art and all that. It was great. You guys should check that video out. We'll try to put it on the eye buff as well. Uh, and again, guys, uh, but without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Uh, we'll go ahead and uh, open. Uh, I'm a little close to the camera, but that's okay. We're just gonna do it like this, and whatever pulls we get, we're just gonna put it up here. So we got Snorlax, Summerset, uh, Station, and Lapras. So we'll start with Snorlax. Uh, also, guys, remember dollar packs only have one thing and one thing only, and that is three cards, and that's it. There's nothing else other than three cards. Uh, also, another news, guys. I was thinking, trying to reward people that uh, are part of the channel, or want to support the channel, and all that goodness. We got PayPal. Maractus and Pikachu so nothing there I want to reward people and I was thinking well once I get to a little bit more subscribers maybe 250 uh, I might do a face reveal at that point so you guys know what I look like at the moment you know we're just doing this for fun I love doing this and it's a great hobby I do it for the views for the you know people to enjoy this I enjoy it I obviously do this real life as well I take him to tournaments and such into uh, my hobby stores and all that with the current pandemic I'm not able to because they're closed down but as soon as they open and they get back on I will probably start going back out to play uh, TCG but as I was saying guys I want to get to 250 subscribers Elder Gross, Larry Mouth and Rare Candy not bad so it's a reverse we'll take it let's go ahead and see if Lapras got something good for us they always do uh, but yeah, once I hit 250 subscribers, I might do a face reveal, uh, and I might set up a Patreon account. I'm not sure yet. I've heard a lot of things about Patreon, but if I do Patreon, I will do a reward system for that. Energy, Sinistee, and Hood Hood. Hood. Nice! Uh, so that was from Lapras. So Lapras got a uh, reverse Hood Hood. That's not bad at all. But yeah, guys, I was thinking of doing some kind of reward system, maybe go through a whole month of pulls and whatever kind of pulls we get if we get double duplicates of stuff we already have we just give them out you know to to the uh supporters of the channel you know people that watch the channel people that support the channel even with whatever amount we'll do some giveaways for those patrons uh for the pools that we have some ultra rare rainbow rares wherever we pull uh we got energy sabo in nothing well actually that's rare come uh come around is a rare and that was from uh summer center so summer center got a pull and remember guys, this pack battle is up to you guys to so let me know who do you think had the best pull. So far, everybody's had a pull, either a reverse or a rare, except for Snorlax. Man, Snorlax is really sleeping on this one. Like, he is really falling asleep on this one. Here we go, we got Kingler, Galarian Mouth, and Solicipede. So nothing there, guys. That's okay. We can't expect to get a 100% pull ratio. I mean, you know we want to but <laughs> the fact of the matter is we're just opening cards and um 
I think I'm also just gonna say this. If you wanna have a pack battle with me, I don't mind it at all. It's just that be mindful that I might not be able to work it as soon as possible, but I will do it, you know. Vitality Ban, Galarian Mouth, and Score Bunny. Score Bunny it is. Uh, so Snorlax still has to pull a single card. Uh, let's start, uh, oh, we gotta finish with Lapras. That's the fourth pack. We only opened three. Let's open the fourth pack of this round. Uh, but yeah, I was thinking of that. I mean, I did Joseph Weaver. And I've done uh, pack battles with Epic Tooth twice and lost twice. I hope we win the next one. Watch out, I'm coming for you, Epic. Energy, Chimchow, and a Krugnut. Uh So yeah, I was thinking I would just do pack battle with you guys on Wednesdays. Uh, if you guys want to do pack battles, if you're a subscriber and you just want to do one for a quick video, see how you feel about, you know, maybe doing videos yourself, you know. Uh, by all means, contact me either through Instagram or Twitter. And I'll be happy to do this with you, you know, and uh, just we, we just got to work it out. Uh, any other Pukatuber out there that wants to pack battle for fun, let me know as well. I'll be happy to do that with you guys. Uh, but here we go. Curvus Wire, Silicipede, and Noctowl. And that is a rare. So, Snorlax finally gets a pull. So, everybody has a pull so far. Two reverse and two rares. Interesting. Interesting. The two on the right got the reverse and the two on the left have rares. That is That is interesting. But let's go. Let's go ahead and open this Summer Center pack. Because we're on round number three of the dollar packs. Here we go. We got Lumberry, Grookey, and Kufant. Kufant, Kufant. Kufant, my friends. I really want to see how that Copper Jar Raja uh, deck works out now. The, the Copper Raja V and the Copper Raja V Max. I mean, it's a, it's a tank. It has a lot of HP. I wonder how people are going to use it. And um, you guys seen my Lapras deck, and I think the next deck that I truly want to work on is going to be a Sable Light. I got to make that work. Hit more. Joltik, and... Ooh, Mudsdale, and that is a reverse rare. And I believe we got that from Station. Station, Station, Station. So Station's pulling ahead with the reverse rare. That is nice. I love to pull all these cards from Dollar Packs because there's nothing you are guaranteed other than three cards and three cards alone. I do hope we get some ultra rares. I really want to see an ultra rare right now. Dutler, Pinchurum, and Blick Bug. Blick Bug it is. So, here we go with the last packs. So we got four, one of each. I think we should start with, um, we'll start with Samacenta. See what's happened. We haven't started with Samacenta. Um, I hope Samacenta gets something really good to just kind of even the odds or just surpass the odds with a rainbow metal saucer Cobra, and another blick bug <laughs> we got two blick bugs in a row guys uh, let's go ahead and see what Snorlax has and we'll leave uh, Station and uh, Lapras for the end as uh, so Lapras has been pretty good in the past we'll hopefully get something more oh quick ball nice Scorpion. and a reverse Rust Raid, and that is a reverse rare. So Rust Raid has a rare and a reverse rare, while Sation has a reverse and a reverse rare. So one has a rare and one has a reverse. That's the difference. Let's see who pulls ahead. Maybe, maybe this is all for nothing. And Lapras just brings out some gold out here to us and says, yeah, I got you Golden Sation and Gold Samacenta. We got fire energy, ball toy, and nothing. <laughs> At least it's not a square cut like previous cards. They gave us so many square cuts when we did that uh, March Madness. That was a great, great moment. You know, like I think I pulled like four packs of square cards on two different occasions, on two different battles, I should say. But here we go. We got Hunter, Sinistee, and is Sation gonna pull away? With a Sobble! Haha! <laughs> Sobble for the rescue! There it is, guys. But before we go, I wanna open some Unbroken Bonds. Because I haven't opened Unbroken Bonds dollar packs. So we have four right here. We're gonna go ahead and open four dollar packs, four Unbroken Bonds. See what kind of pull rate we have here. Uh, we have a, This one actually has that cold card type of thing right there. Uh, and remember, we actually pulled that full art Resha Shard from a dollar pack. Him on top. Piglet and Slowpoke. Nothing there. I love me some dollar packs. Dollar packs are awesome, guys. You know, I, I, 
if, if you know someone that does something to the dollar packs to change the odds, don't support it, guys. It's hard to go buy dollar packs and hoping for some good pulls, and then you get absolutely nothing. Well, we got a rare right here. So that's good. We got a rare for our um, Unbroken Bonds dollar pack. But yeah, guys, don't support that. Don't support scamming other people because they're not scamming Pokemon. They're not cheating Pokemon. The Pokemon company is making their money. Who they're cheating is those young ones that want to play Pokemon and they get a few dollars on the weekend. So they go to the dollar stores with their parents and say, okay, you can have anything you want. And they pick out dollar packs and they never get a chance to pull anything because people have gone in there and done something to the packs. So they get better pull rates than the rest of us. And the ones that really suffer is the community. The community, the young community that is aspiring to play this, and then from really young, we're disappointing them. So if you buy dollar packs, just buy them. Don't do anything to them. Be supportive of the community. Metapod, coughing, and do duo, do duo, do duo, do duo. So yeah, guys, that that's my opinion on that. And by all means, I support everybody. I want everybody to have fun and enjoy. Let's go ahead and open four more packs of unbroken bonds. We have a few more, so we'll go ahead and open four more. So, that's my opinion on that, guys. Please support the community. Give back to the community. My, my way of giving back to the community, sometimes when I go back to um, to the uh, game card or game store, however, or game shop, however you want to call it, I usually just take all my, my uh, Tarot, Poliwag, and Spritzy. I take all my bulk, and if there's new kids or new people in general, you know, whatever the age is, and they're just getting into Pokemon, I like to say, hey, what you have, you know, what kind of deck are you looking for, or what, what is it that you like to learn, or whatever. Try to teach them a little bit of what I know. I'm not an expert by any means, but I do play Torcat, Ghastly, and Tangela. Uh, so I teach them whatever I know, and if I have cards that can help them, you know, get their deck going, or help them just you know, feel better about the gameplay and not fully just losing, um on the game uh because that's how they might feel oh fire crystal we actually pulled this out of a dollar card gold it was awesome uh sand Isle and a meow so you know i try to help them out that's that's my way of going back to the community uh i resell my stock to um to the to the uh game store because that way they have stocks to sell to people you know in, the, in uh, singles so i do that as well we got him on top litton and a surprise box we got a surprise box surprise box guys I, I just love opening dollar packs and i can just go on forever guys but we cannot do that so guys again guys thank you so much for joining me i love you guys i wish the best for you guys and stay tuned for friday we are going to open more cars on friday i don't know what to open leave in the comment section below you want to see some shining legends uh maybe some evolutions with that or would you like to see another hidden fates let me know comment section below Hashtag Killer Face, hashtag uh, Shiny Legends uh, Evolutions. Let me know what you guys want to know, see open on Friday, and I'll be happy to get that going. And I will definitely be more into my notifications to see that. And again, guys, thank you so much for joining me in the channel. I hope you had a wonderful day. And remember, never stop opening. See ya.